this is reminding me of my high school days when i used to start my vlogs late because i couldn't start recording until after my last class so girl today's gonna be a super rant don't you ever come in my room like that <laughs> today's gonna be a super random thank you a random vlog because I literally don't know what to do and I've wasted all my time today. I woke up, actually I woke up pretty late, I woke up at like 8.30 and then I sat in my bed and I drank an energy drink and water and I watched like a bunch of podcasts and sermons and then I went downstairs and I talked with my family. When they left I played with the dogs and then I came upstairs, I detangled my hair, did my hair, skincare, you know everything, body care, got ready and then I'm being so annoying. But I put on mascara for the first time in year. Jordan, are they caution taping off that house? Oh, they're caution taping off the whole neighborhood. I was like, oh my gosh, please don't tell me there's a crime scene. Scene. Yeah. Imagine? Yeah, they are doing the whole thing. Why are they doing the whole neighborhood? I know, right? They must be. Are they redoing the street? Okay, that looks scary. That was weird. But there's no like FBI cars or like crime scene cars. <laughs> that scared me, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, um, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, I did my mascara for the first time in years because y'all know I've been getting lash extensions for so long. And I did my top eyes and I was like, oh, this looks cute. And then I did my bottoms and I hated it because it made my under eyes look even darker because for some reason, as of lately, my under eyes have been a little dark. And I'm going to get my blood tested soon by my doctor just to make sure everything is okay. Um, because that looks a little weird and I feel like it could be a deficiency. I don't know. Still going to get my blood tested and get my blood ran, but I believe I've cracked the case. Case, this morning I woke up and my eyes, look at my eyes. And my mom has been telling me for a while, like, anemia runs in my family. She had it growing up, like, iron deficiency anemia and stuff like that. And I just haven't really been listening. And, like, I've had my family members tell me, like, they struggle with it and stuff like that. And it runs on my family, iron deficiency anemia. My mom struggled with it her entire life. And um, I've been looking it up. So finally this morning I looked it up. And the headaches that I've been having, they're saying, like, if you have, like, persistent headaches, of course, darker under eyes, you know, like, I have, like, so many different symptoms of it, like, the shortness of breath, the fatigue, the dizziness, um, cold hands and feet. I believe that's what it is. It's iron deficiency. So I'm going to start taking my slow release iron every single day because I'm not that consistent with it. Um at all and my mom's been telling me like those are the symptoms of iron deficiency like you need to start taking your iron i just haven't i haven't been listening so like look at this freaking eye and it's not makeup so i think i cracked the case and i'm really happy about it because i'm finally gonna be able to do something about it and it's weird because it's like i knew it but i just didn't want to listen like i didn't want to like accept it because okay like a week ago i was taking my iron and my under eyes cleared up and i was feeling better but i was like no and i just stopped using it and here i am um so i didn't like that i mean my under eyes look darker so i put concealer on and i was like oh my gosh this is kind of cute but i kind of want to do like a full face so then i did my whole face and then after that Jordan got home and I had him take me to Ulta and I bought a bunch of eyelashes and now here we are. This is reminding me, Jordan, when I was in high school, I used to have to wait till I got out of like my last period and then I was able to film, but I would have to get ready and then start filming. And yeah, your girl was on a grind, okay, from morning to night. Okay, yeah, it was no joke, okay? Life was, it was difficult, but it was very much so worth it. Okay, what am I talking about? I'm drinking a Baja Blast and he just got me some water. Since I'm talking about that I just went eyelash shopping, shopping, I might as well try out the eyelashes I just bought because aren't these eyelashes popping? These are some popping lashes, y'all. <laughs> My makeup looks cute too. Very. Thank you. So yeah, random vlog. Don't rev your engine. Engine. Super random vlog because I'm starting super late and at this point I don't even know what to do. I never had Jordan put together those shoe shelves for me because I, I want to put them together myself. So I want to be Bob the Builder today and I'm going to put together these shoe shelves. I'm excited. And then I'm going to put some clothes away. I'm going to unpack some more clothes. Yes, I have more clothes. No, I mean... <laughs> Yes, I have more clothes to unpack because I have that many clothes and I'm gonna go ahead and unpox unpox Girl keep going. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. We starting again I'm gonna unbox some more clothing because I bought a like it's for shoes But it's kind of like an armoire. I'll show you guys later. I had Jordan put it together for me I got it on Wayfair um, just to have more clothes put away and have more space for clothes It's in my hallway kind of like my hallway, but it's in the stair area. Yes Like I told y'all I'm utilizing every single crick and cranny in this house and my makeup looks cute mm -hmm. oh, I already said that I think I kind of slayed it y'all eyelash haul 
So these are these lashes right here. So I went and at least got one more. Did I get two? Yeah, I got two. Oh my gosh, knowing me, you got, I gotta stock up. And since I've been noticing that the eyelashes that I've been buying as of lately have been like, they ain't been twins. They just sisters. And they is not close sisters because they don't look together. Um, I went through all of them. This is gonna sound bad, but I took out all the lashes off the rack and I laid them down on the floor. Yes, on the floor. And I looked at all of them and I looked and these two were the most similar. So I went and got these lashes. These are the My Lashes But Bolder in the style Slim Thick. So we got the Slim Thick My Lash But Better Lashes. But Bolder, my bad. My Lash But Better. <laughs> Making my own things up. Okay, these are really short but they're super curly and they're dark looking so since they're curly these will probably be the lashes i wear when i'm not wearing makeup even though i haven't really been wearing lashes like that but i want to get back on my lashes even when i'm not wearing makeup so i bought these because these look like lash extensions the ultimate lash extensions look i knew it and they're super curly like they have like a d curl so i bought these because look how curly them things are matter of fact let me take y'all over here oh my gosh these look a little bit different you guys i'm not sure why i didn't like pay attention to how different these two lashes look but oh well like i said if i ever want to like um wear lashes and i'm not wearing makeup i think these will be super perfect because they're so curly look how curly those things are you guys um, what was I going to say? Oh yeah, I was going to say that if I ever did want to get lash extensions again, I did find a really good lash tech, um, near me, but I just, okay, this is the truth. Anytime I ever like went to get my lashes done for some reason, each and every time I dreaded it and I just had anxiety going. And so I just preferred wearing my own lashes at home. They don't look as good as lash extensions, honestly, because lash extensions are like them girls, but I'm working on it until I perfect it because I do not like going to get my lashes done. I don't. And then let's say your lashes fall out like a little bit early. They're like on your tail about it. And I'm like, what about you might want to check yourself? Anyways, so um, yeah, if I did ever want to, I could, but I'm working on, I'm working with these right now. I got these cause these are super bold and I feel like these are gonna be super cute. They're pretty curly and they're long and I love that. And then I got these, look how curly them things in. Y'all, look how curly these lashes are. These are the curliest, like, individuals I have ever seen in my life. So I got these. Hopefully I like those because those were expensive. Those were like $17. So I really hope those work out. And then I got some more lash glue. Y'all, I've been looking for this lash glue, ugh, lash glue for so long. I love to have the lash glue with the brush because it's more precise and it's easier. And the duo glue smells like fish like it stinks so bad and this is gonna sound gross listen this is gonna sound gross but let me just say it if you have a dog you know it smells like when their anal glands are backed up I, i'm jordan stop i'm being serious i went to use duo glue the other day for the first time and then last but not least i love the kiss sister nature lashes so i bought these these are different than the ones that i usually use but these are the sage ones oh my gosh they're so freaking cute so let me actually lay these out so I can get like a little thumbnail. I'm drinking on some Baja Blast. I didn't know it had that much caffeine in it because I've already had a rain today. That has 98 milligrams of caffeine. And I was like, wait a minute, I've already drank a rain and rain has 300 milligrams. So I think I'm surpassing the amount. So hopefully I don't end up in the hospital. That's not really a funny joke. Sorry about that. Flash home. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And these ran me 6035. Yes, I have a new addiction. Eyelashes. I was gonna buy some makeup, but my mom and I wanna go makeup shopping soon. So I didn't wanna do that because the other day I came home with that Sephora bag I did in my recent get ready with me. I went to Sephora. My mom was like, you went to Sephora? And I was like, yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't get the stuff that we was planning on getting together though. I just got the stuff that I liked seeing cause you know, so. I didn't want to do that again, so I did not buy any makeup. She don't even wear lashes, so I just bought lashes because her and I are going to go makeup shopping soon because, like I said, we're getting into makeup, and I think my makeup is so good today. Mm, I love it. Okay, let's start building these shoe storages. Shoe storages. Eyebrows are so fleeky today. It is out of this world. My eyelashes look so good, you guys. I had the most fun I've ever had doing my makeup today. I was listening to music, and I was just, like, dancing and doing my makeup, and I swear to gosh, this is, like, the best makeup look I've ever done, and I had so much fun. Fun! I swear to gosh, like my family had somewhere to be today and I knew it was gonna take a while. Girl, by the time I was into my makeup, they were already home. I'm like, wait a minute. I've been doing it for that long. I looked up and it was already two o'clock. I was like, oh my gosh. Yeah. Bob the builder, builder, build. Are you ready, babe? 
I'm about to slay the mother freaking bamboo shoe shells. If y'all want these, come get them. I'm just playing. Um, I'm gonna link them down below. I got them off of Wayfair. I'm gonna link these bamboo shoe shells down below. Don't ever do that again. In a minute, I'm gonna go downstairs, grab a box of clothes, and then we'll start putting away some more clothes. And um, I'm gonna show you guys my new clothing storage. And then depending on um, how I'm feeling, I might clean my bathroom again. My bathroom, like look it, I can have a dirty room. If my bathroom's dirty, oh my gosh, it bothers my mental so bad. My man, so. It's the next day, I just got done editing the vlog that you guys are watching right now and I went ahead and straightened up my room. It's not perfect, but I am so happy that I got my butt up after being on the laptop all day and I cleaned my room. Do not mind my little Starbucks cups down there and my energy drink. I keep my little Starbucks cups up here, but um, yeah, I did straighten up and I'm very proud of myself. I organized all my makeup in my drawers and I'm feeling good. I am feeling good. Um, I don't think I want to do this. <laughs> Hold on. Um, babe? I don't think I'm about that life no more. This goes like this. And I know these things go like, right? Like, yeah, like this. So I have to line them up like that, and I have to do that a million times. Um, babe, can you help me actually? Girl, I be getting hyped for what? I'm not even about to do it. You can't help you as in put it together? Yeah. I don't think I want to do this. It looks so simple on the picture, but this ain't really my, my cup of tea. Oh, my tea. Oh my gosh, these are gonna be so cute though. Get your tall glass of water self over here. <laughs> Remember when I was telling you guys about the lady in Sephora on my wrist and get ready with me? Um, cause she was talking about how pretty I am. And um, she was like, I mean, you are too. You you so handsome. You like a you like a tall glass of water. <laughs> here, these are the screws. Get at it. Mmm. Refreshing. Okay, girl, let's start putting away some clothes. So this is another box of clothing. <laughs> Y'all remember on my packing vlog when I was packing away clothes and we accidentally kept putting like Chloe, like clothing. It was like so annoying, but we kept doing it on accident. Also, the handwriting looks like chicken scrap because we wrote it upside down. His was the top, mine was the bottom. We wrote it upside down to see who could write upside down better. I promise you, none of us, none of us write like that. But even if, hey, doctors have like the worst handwriting, so it doesn't matter. I'm, I'm just want to let you guys know because my handwriting is already embarrassing enough, and I don't want it to be even worse. So, um, so I'm gonna go ahead and unpack this box of clothes and put it in here. So I'm gonna link this down below as well. Um, so this is the little shoe storage thing Jordan put together for me. It's actually like for shoe storage and I'm using it for clothes so what I had him do was I had him put in every other shelf instead of every shelf so if you actually click the link down below and you see what this thing looks like there's a million shelves that go into it but I had him you know exclude some of them because I wanted it to be for my clothes can I open it a little bit babe yeah see so there's actually supposed to be like a million shelves, but I had him do like every other one so I could fit clothes in it. And yes, I'm using this little, this little um, stair area because my mom was like, you know what, it would be a good idea if you just use this little area right here and I can fit like another one. And then we'll see what I want to do with that little cute organizer. I put like um, tissue and paper towel in there, so we'll just see. But I can at least put away a box of clothes in here and depending on how much clothes I have on my floor in my room, I may be able to put a little bit more. But listen, you guys, this is the most comical thing we are ever gonna talk about on my channel. Is comical the right word? I don't know. This is the funniest thing we are ever going to experience on my channel. You see this big old box? You would think I ordered a million items from Ulta. No, look. <laughs> look how big this box is. So I went on the Ulta website the other day because I wanted to make sure that these, hold on, is that oven still on? Oh my gosh, I knew I was smelling the oven. Hold on, let me go curse Brent out because he left the oven on again. I knew something didn't smell right. No, I'm just gonna tell my mom. Mom, can you curse Brent out and tell him that he left the oven on again at 425 and it smells burnt? Oh my gosh. Yeah, I get him. It smells burnt to a crisp. What was I saying? Oh my gosh, Um, I went on the Ulta website 
because I don't want these to like go out of stock because I'm pretty sure these are limited edition but they're so freaking cute. So I went on there to see if they had stopped selling them or not. Or not. And these were originally $16.99 and they had them for $9.50. So I bought two for me and two for my mom. I'll leave my mom's right here. She'll know they're hers. So I bought two for me, two for my mom. And girl, I'm still locked up. So I got these for so cheap. But they came in this gigantic box. I, I, I lifted it up because I was like, this can't be mine. But I looked on the label and it had my name. So I opened it up. What the frick? Move, pumpkin seed. Pumpkin. Move. And then here, I ordered some little Real Technique sponges for my concealer. And I ordered some more antibacterial toothpaste. I haven't tried this one yet. But I love antibacterial toothpaste because it makes your breath smell so good. And my wisdom teeth are coming in. So like my gum... I have like a flappy gum. It's weird. And I don't like how it can cause an odor underneath there when the bacteria builds up. Why are you crying? Jordan, she really wants you. Yeah, she's looking up in here. Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> she's itching her way up. You cannot. No, pumpkin. <laughs> Go down there, beauty. No. No. Um, I don't like how it can like taste weird and smell weird. So I got more bacterial, antibacterial toothpaste. And I found out about this because somebody from, um, my girl Monica from New Zealand sent me some antibacterial toothpaste. And girl, it helped me so much because when I looked up why like underneath my gum was like tasting weird and like smelling weird, they said it was the bacteria buildup. So I started using the antibacterial toothpaste she got me because I was like, wait, I remember she um, sent me that. Started to use it. Oh my gosh, eliminated all odor. And on top of that, my breath smells so freaking good. So my mom was having some pain in her tooth the other day and I was telling her, not the other day, but like a couple weeks ago, and I was telling her it might be the bacteria because she's got like um, implants in her mouth. And um, I said, you might want to try antibacterial toothpaste. I'm gonna go get her one of those actually because the one that she uses is whitening and I don't want it to like, like make her teeth sensitive. So um, she started to use it and it helped with the pain. So I was like, oh my gosh, bacteria really does a number of things it causes odor it causes pain so that's the one i was able to find on amazon i'm gonna actually you know what i haven't tried it yet so i'm not gonna put it on my amazon storefront they had so many good reviews on it you guys it's the hello bye 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 bacteria it says it's got fluoride and everything kills bad breath bacteria i don't know why we don't have like a bunch of antibacterial toothpaste in the stores because this is what we really need to prevent bad breath I don't know why it's open. This is what we truly need to prevent bad breath, and they don't carry these in store. The only antibacterial toothpaste I was ever able to find was at, what, CVS? But it has whitening in it, and not everybody likes to use whitening products, so I'm going to go give this to my mom. My mom is, like, one of the most grateful people ever. My mom's not, like, one of those moms that's, like, an opportunist and, like, like expects things from people like everything that i do for my mom or have done for my mom or will continue to do for my mom she is one of the most grateful people like like this is this is the reality if i decided like with my money to move elsewhere and not do anything for her she would not hold that against me like she would be the type that's like girl it's your money like do what you gotta do that's always been her she's not that type that expects anything from her kids or like uses her kids for anything she never has and she never will that's my mom and it's the truth okay oh i love this freaking jacket it is so cute i got it so cheap at what charlotte rose you guys so cute so i guess i'll just um start folding these clothes and just start putting them in this little storage cabinet because girl i need the storage girl we need it <laughs> this is cute too i got this little gown years back it's like a little calvin klein gown oh you can't see it there we go all right we're gonna have to get you guys a better angle because this one's not really working out. Another reason why I really gotta get a move on these dang boxes is Essence has been biting all my boxes. She's been tearing all my boxes up for fun. I was doing my makeup earlier and I heard a <laughs> came out here. She's tearing my boxes up. I'm like, little girl, what is up with you? That's um, what did I come? Don't <laughs> you hear him? That's my baby. I'll beat you up. I'll, I'll give you a knuckle sandwich. Oh, grandpa used to say that all the time. I swear to gosh, this is my new favorite drink. Jordan, you need to give me more Baja Blast. I swear to gosh, I could yell at my dogs some blue in the face and their tails, <laughs> they'll still wag. Those tails are still gonna wag. I swear to gosh, they take me seriously for nothing. They take me serious for nothing, for nothing. They never take me serious. They always think I'm playing around till I get real mean out of nowhere. Girl sitting up wondering why. Well, you took my, my, my love for granted. Every time I'm like, you better go somewhere. And they're just wagging, jumping on me. Girl, how do you get your dogs to fear you? Because at this point, <laughs> I don't really want them to fear me, but I want them to understand. I want, I want respect. 
R E S P E C T. Okay, no, I am not organizing these um clothing, like this, these clothes, like jackets with jackets, shirts with shirts. No, I'm just putting a bunch of different clothes in there. I've always been that way. Um, that's me, and I've accepted it. You know, I've tried. To <laughs> I've I've gone into stages where like I've tried to be like everybody else and like get more organized and stuff like that But realistically it doesn't make me happy and realistically. It's not my it's not where I'm talented It's not like my expertise if that makes sense. So oh, this is a super cute jacket Girl, I need to get back to garage not need I want to get back to garage, but realistically their clothes have been getting a little bit uglier and um, I have enough clothes, but we all know that won't last for long. I have enough clothes. Yeah next day more clothes I love this thing. My mom is such a genius. She bought these for her clothes and um, it fits a good amount. And she told me like, girl, you need to go ahead and do that and put them right here. I love these pants, you guys. I got these in Miami and I wore this outfit like twice. Oops. And I wore this freaking outfit. It's so cute. It came with the top and everything. Not came with. I think it was like separate and I had to like pay for both pieces. I wore this to like this little church event and everybody there was like dressed like soup i'm not trying to be funny because you can you can be classy and still be like stylish they were dressed so boring and they all looked miserable you want to tell me why they all look miserable and they're mean because girl mm -hmm, wore the outfit there because they don't believe that you're allowed to wear pants they were so freaking rude the offering basket was going around and i was listening to the guy preaching so i didn't really see the person passing the bucket to me the lady behind me tapped my shoulder and was like i was like <laughs> Okay, yeah, get on my mm, get on my dang face. I'm not about to sit up here and play with you because you look miserable. You've been looking at me the entire dang time, sitting up eyeing me because I look good. Yeah, my outfit's cute. Mm-hmm. Everybody there was like side eyeing me. I'm like, let me get out of here. Let me go. I said I'm not about to deal with this. I'm not standing for none of y'all little weird activities. Cause <laughs> don't play with me. All y'all look miserable. All y'all feel like God loves y'all more because you're freaking skirts are down to your ankles ah uh, yeah i'll answer the picture here of my outfit that night still classy still looking cute but they was miserable very mad realistically i think they're insecure and i think that's why they were mad love these shorts my brother and i got these matching if y'all remember like that miami shopping vlog these are like adidas shorts they're so cute you guys i love them anyways um i guess i'll just speed these clips up okay i guess i'll just spit them up don't mind my messy hallway I'm still getting stuff situated but so that was all the clothes in that box and when I went downstairs I'm not really seeing any more like clothing boxes I think there's one more but it's tucked behind um some stuff we have downstairs and I can't really get to it so I'm gonna go get some clothes that I have folded on my floor in my room put them in there and then when I find the other clothing box if there even is another one um I'm just like thinking there is because when I went downstairs I seen a box of notebooks games and um notepads I have to figure out where the heck I'm gonna put that stuff at and then I seen a box of shoes and then I seen a box of cleaning products and I seen two po two boxes of hygiene products my hygiene closet is very full right now so what I'm thinking I'm also going to do is get another one of these shoe organizers and fill it up with hygiene products. But I'm going to bring a box of hygiene products up to see what I can stuff in that closet because I've just been stuffing stuff in there. Yeah, we got lots to figure out. But I'm going to order another one of these so that I can figure out or so that I can put more hygiene products in it because I know I have like two more boxes. And then I probably should use another one for shoes because I ordered, obviously I have those two shoe storage things, but... I already have enough shoes to go in those so I got to figure out where I'm also going to put and I have one more box of shoes and if you know you know that my shoes are stacked shack high in that dang closet so let me go grab these clothes here's just like styrofoam 
from that dang shoe storage. Here's just two pillows I just washed on top of laundry powder. Shadrack, Meshack, and Abednego. On the floor, I look good, touch my swine. When you smoke can hang. I put um, these sheets out. I put these sheets and some towels up here. Like I said, I'm gonna order some more of these because I feel like I'm all over the place because I don't know what the frick I'm about to do with the rest of these boxes. Like what I'm about to do with some notepads. Matter of fact, I'm gonna put those notepads and the cube organizer I have in my hallway. Not the one I just showed you guys, but I have like another cube organizer in the hallway and off of camera one of these days, I'm gonna bring that upstairs and put it in that cube organizer. This isn't organized too cute. Um, like it's not like stacked up right, but I will get to that. Or I should probably get to it now. Minka! That'll make it look much better. Look at this Fruit of the Loam shirt. I got it, Zara. <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought it was so cool. And somehow it got messed up. Okay, okay. Well, I'm gonna stuff ya, stuff ya, stuff ya. I don't really care. This is probably bothering some people's organization skills. Oh well, it is what it is. This is my kind of organization skills, watch. And it's disappeared. And it's gone. Phew. A hard day's work. Mm -mm 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 but I just I'm on vacation I don't really care that was hard work another box unpacked like every single box means so much to me because they're so big like I got another box of like random miscellaneous things unpacked yesterday I threw away half of it got that unpacked now I got that unpacked now I'm gonna go grab a hide no I'm not gonna grab a hygiene box I'm not strong enough for that babe I'm sorry I've been working so hard <sighs> I'm working hard, they won't let me out. I clock in, but they won't let me clock out. It's just one of them nights. Yeah, I don't think anything else is gonna fit in here. I don't want these things to like break because this is already like super heavy and I have tons of stuff in here. Also, well, you guys, what? Well, it's doing all that because there's no metal thing back here. They didn't even put one up here. Oh no, it fell it's down one day. Bit. Oh, it did? It fell down one day and it just, it didn't stay up, so. Yeah. I don't know where it went though. Hold on. It's on one of these boxes. It's in here somewhere. I'll find it one of these days, but it's in one of these little boxes. I put it somewhere. Oh, yes. Yes. I did not know I had a whole nother lavender muffin mask. And you know what? Y'all, the other day I was talking about how I needed to get to Sally's Beauty so I could get my gel. I have a whole thing right here. And remember I was talking about how I needed to get some kind of mask for my face? Y'all, look what I found. Look at this, you guys. I found a whole Peter Thomas Roth mask in there. So actually, I don't need to go anywhere. I have a whole shopping, um whole shopping store in my freaking closet. I have a whole nother box of shoes, but there's no way I could fit any more shoes. Let me go on Wayfair and buy another one of those things. Dang, them dang, dang. Ow! I wasted my toe! This is the weirdest vlog. <laughs> Nothing's getting done! I'm on vacay. Okay, I'm gonna go on Wayfair and I'm gonna buy another one of those things. Thing a more jig ass because Literally, I need that for my hygiene products at this point. My toe. Listen, don't play with me. I want to buy another one. So where you at? $183.99 those things are, you guys. But I need it for hygiene products. So at this point, it doesn't even matter because my mom was like, <laughs> she was like, girl, you think, you think one of them things is a lot? I already bought like seven of them. I'm like, she said, I spent thousands, thousands. Girl, I don't want to spend thousands. And I always get like at least like a protection plan on it for like a year because they're really good with their protection plans. They have wheels on them too, you guys. I'm gonna order this one because it's I need it. 183.99 plus 7.99 protection. 203 foilers. Foilers. Boy, Garoos. Hmm. I gotta redo my lips. Apple Pay. You know what? It's so cool because I think it's going to be here super soon. What does it say it's going to be here? I'll let you know in a minute. Even though you didn't even ask. That's embarrassing. I don't know what this vlog was for. I, I really don't. This one's going to take longer. It's going to take like five days instead of three. Oh, how dare them. All right, so I bought another one. You're going to have to put that together for me too. Thanks. I don't and think I'm going to be available that day.
I'll just call Norton over. I call him Norton, you guys. <sighs> Vacation is great. Let me go clean off these dang counters because my counters are bothering me. Girl, I got so much stuff on these counters. I have a towel in the sink. Like, what is going on? Don't play with me, Jordan. <laughs> I have a wet swimsuit. Make sure you change your razors, guys, because, girl, it'll cut you up. Make sure if your razors are ever rusty. Look, my dad was, like, really cheap when it came down to, like, getting me what I needed. And I was like, Mom, but, like, my razors have, like, rust on them now. And she was like, tell your dad that. I promise you, if you tell him that, he don't play about rusty razors. Like, he'll get you the razors. She was like, he taught me about that. Like, if your razors are getting rusty, instantly replace them because it's so dangerous to shave with a rusty razor. If that gets into your blood... Oh my gosh, like look it up. It's so freaking dangerous. So my mom didn't have like enough money to give me what I needed because he wasn't paying a child support. And um, all of her money was going to food, gas, everything that we like needed. And um, I was like, dad, but like my razors are getting rusty. He's like, what'd you say? I was like, they're rusty and I'm still shaving with them. He's like, oh, I'm gonna, we'll go to Dollar General today. We'll get you what you need. I was like, dang, you were right, mom. <laughs> See, we got a whole store up in this mug. I got my razor replacements. Oh! My Noiko! Not coming to you. Don't tell me to come here. <laughs> Norton! My Noiko! Alright. Where the heck is all this stuff going to go? these cups in my room until I decide to clean them because my brother accidentally put one in the dishwasher and my cap won't screw on right. I'm so sad about it. How does soap get come out of this thing? Like I don't understand. It is the cutest soap dispenser but so much soap comes out of it. So if you do have any whites, it would be perfect because I want to throw these rugs in the washer again. these here because it looks cluttery. This is not a disinfectant, but it smells so good. I'm just going to use it on everything. The Spray Away Lavender Glass Cleaner. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I wonder if I could use this on my shower, like on the actual glass of the shower. Am I gonna do it? I 
I think I want to try it, you guys. This is going to be like one of the weird experiments. Why am I holding this in the air? This is going to be a weird experiment, but I'm going to try it on my shower. Because if I can use this thing on my shower, oh my gosh, you guys, I have cracked the code to all cleaning. Swear to gosh. And then I'm going to go online and order a million more of these toilet wands. Because, oh my freaking gosh. If this works, I swear to gosh, I'm gonna be so happy. If you don't know what I'm talking about, this is the Clorox Wonder Wand, like toilet Wonder Wand. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna get it wet. Okay. <sighs> Let's start scrubbing. My glass looks good. I am the biggest genius I have ever met. I mean, it's looking like it's going pretty crazy. It's looking like it's going pretty crazy. I'm not going to hold you up. Oh my gosh, Jordan. I think I'm a genius. If anybody does this after me, you know who did it for <laughs> <laughs> Jordan, I'm in the show all cleaning. <laughs> Why do I keep doing an accent? First of all, I think the, um, the British accent is the cutest accent in the world. I think it's so freaking cool. Um, so I'm not using anybody just now. Okay, I'm gonna rinse it. Let's see what happens. Here, hold this. Actually, no. I will just put it um in the sink. Minka! Oh, my camera's about to overheat. Can you? My camera's gonna overheat. I'm gonna let it sit for a minute and then I'll come back. This is the grand reveal. It's looking good so far. It's looking good so far. It is. It really is. I'm going to dry it with a paper towel and see what happens. Mm. Yeah, that might be it. This might be it. If this is the case, my mom's going to be like, you're so brilliant. <laughs> I mean, she said it since I was in the room. All right. Give me that roll of paper towel. I should be using my squeegee, but oh well. Yeah, you should definitely should. I don't want to. I like to work hard. Okay, this is using up too much paper towel. I think I'm being wasteful. Squeegee. And microfiber washcloth. Yeah, that's it. I'm being wasteful. Where my microfiber's at? Oh, downstairs. It worked. It like, be. swear to gosh, it worked. There's like no weird marks. It actually worked. <laughs> I'm a genius! In your face! Actually, I, I think like, yeah, I think a couple months I did tell you that you should. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So guess what I did because I'm a genius? Just to shine it up. Mm -hmm. I'm 
find the smartest in the world. Freaking Elon Musk! <laughs> I'm serious. Oh, ow. Smartest in the world, give it to me. My mom was gonna kill me when she watches this footage and see how much paper towel offers I wasted. Nice and squeaky clean. I'm letting that stuff dry because that's a little outfit I wore or the swimsuit I wore when I did my recent video. I'm letting that dry out because I had it just sitting in the sink. I don't know what the heck. My shower's clean and everything looks great. These turned out so cute, you guys. Oh my gosh, even cuter than I imagined. I am in love with these. Let me start putting the shoes on them. I'm gonna have to dry these to a good will to drop these off. I got a couple other things I need to drop off anyway, so it's perfect. Does it go that way? Yeah, it goes this way. Perfect. Oh my gosh, I love that. Dude, how cute. Should I put them this way? Or this way. I guess that way is cuter. Okay. That's cute. These are so dirty, you guys, because literally haven't worn these since I lived with my mom. In the winter time, like all the dirt and like the um, the salt would like drip down into my crocs from other people's boots because they were on like a lower level and that's how dirty they are. I need to clean them. All right. How cute, you guys. I'm sorry. This is the cutest thing ever. See how cute this is! Oh my gosh, I didn't know you were in your room. I thought you were downstairs. Oh, that was a, yeah, that was all right. Nice. Do you need any more pillows? So I just wash these pillows. Do you need any more? I'll take the bottom one because okay. it's fluffy. Fluffy. Yes. Go ahead, please. <laughs> I didn't know I even had clothes in here, so I'm gonna fold these up. I love these little hair towels you got me, Jordan. They are lifesavers. Yeah, those look so cool. I like them. Yeah, they look cool and they work amazing. It's crazy that everything, like that outfit, really picks up everything. If you watch my Get Ready With Me, you know that that Jodora cream I use, it like seeps straight through. But I do like how things do come out of it easy too. I was like, immediately, no. That was pretty tragic. So I gotta figure out a day where I can actually like wear that outfit and like not eat anything basically <laughs> or wear anything because the first time it got messed up from soup, second time it got messed up from body cream. Like what can I, how can I win with that outfit? Somebody keeps texting me. Oh, oh, oh. What the? <laughs> Try to take me out. It was you. It was you. I know it was. I would have had a freaking lump on my head. This cannot be my shirt. Whose shirt is that? I don't know. It's like random stuff is just popping up in my laundry. Always make sure you guys are... Dang! It's like a pallet, dude! All that came out of that. You know what it came from? That black jacket. There's black dust everywhere from that dang black Speedway, Speedway oh, racer yeah. jacket. Look it. That's wild. It's like a freaking rug. That makes it look like it's part of it. 
What the heck? That's bad. Oh my gosh. That was very unfortunate. I put your pillowcase in the washer with mines too. So I'm putting it in the dryer now to be clean tonight. You gotta start changing them pillowcases, boy. I feel like you're the type of person that the only time pimples pop up on your face is if you're just not washing your face or if you're not changing your pillowcases because you have like super good skin. I'm the type of person that's just like, hey, screw you. We're gonna do it either way. The laundry so nice. Oh yeah, I decorated this laundry room very well, you guys. If you didn't see, I did all of this. We've never turned those lights on. What lights? I don't want to put them on because I'm scared. Like I'm like electric. I don't know. Like oh, yeah. you know what I mean. Like with the plugs back there and then putting on those, it, it scares me. It, it worries me. overflow of food ever since I like moved back in with my mom <clears throat> is crazy I am so happy first of all there's so much food in this dang house because she cooks so much and then today she went out and got everybody um crispy crunchy chicken if you don't know I'm sorry it is the best chicken ever and I got some tenders and some wedges yesterday she made chicken broccoli and rice casserole her rice is just so greatly seasoned. She made it one time on camera, but she made it so much better this time because she makes her rice so much better. So much better now. Girl, it's so cheesy. I'm about to eat some more tonight because I cannot. She be cooking so much. She she be making sure everybody fed. Okay, well fed. There's so much casserole left. Mm. I can't play. I can't play. I'm so happy that my mom is able to like do the things she's always wanted to do. I've said it before, but like, First of all, my lips were completely messed up. My lips were so cute earlier. Growing up, I know she wanted to have like an overflow of food in the house. We just couldn't really afford it. Food stamps didn't cover all that. But I know that she wanted to always have like so much food in the house. Like anytime she ever got like some extra money, she tried to always make sure there was a good amount of food in the house. Like I know that's what she always wanted and she makes sure she does it now that she can. Because she a mama. Okay, she a mama for real. My mom was never that type to go out to bars and clubs and prioritize men and friends over her kids mm -mm. she was focused strictly on her children because the fact of the matter is you only have so much time with your kids while they're young but trust me it is important to get out and have fun my mom just had bigger things to worry about these lashes are so freaking cute i showed you which ones i'm wearing earlier you guys oh my gosh i just ordered some snacks from dash mart girl i got all kind of stuff i got four gatorades three baja blasts four four bags of these these are my favorite trips so far oh my gosh i love these girl i got everything everything in the book everything i could think of i was just like let me grab it love snacks snacks at nighttime are, are like top tier so i think i think that when i okay when i got matched first of all i seen a commercial i seen a sephora commercial that they're doing like let me stop you right there chloe let me stop you one of your lashes okay it would be it was my right eye but it would be left to you guys you see when i close my eyes and as you can see honestly throughout the video i cut my lashes up and i apply them but i like to apply them up so that they curl one of them it would be this eye to you guys well it's this eye period one of them in the middle was applied more straight than up and you can see even when i close my eyes or even when i open up my eyes it's not as up and it's not as bold it's bothering me but that is okay that is actually another way that I've improved with my makeup. Um, I look at my videos and I see like the imperfections and like the things that I could work on and I try again. The matching with this phone thing and I went in there and I got matched with that thing like twice and it it was the wrong shade both times. So I really wouldn't trust that thing. I would have like an actual person match you because that thing does not work. Also, I would request for it to be like wiped with alcohol. Um, they said it, they cleaned it every single time, but just in case, I would just have them clean it in front of you just because it, it does have to touch your face. I'm not sure if you guys know what I'm talking about, but it's like this, it's like this thing that goes on to their phone 
like the Sephora phone and they put it on your face to match it. Personally, it didn't work for me. I went in there that one time and I got matched for NARS Fiji. Not matched by the phone thing. I was matched by an actual person because the person that was matching me with the phone thing was like, okay, this thing is not matching you right. So I got matched by an actual person and it actually was like perfect. Well, I think I was a little bit like tanner when I got matched for that. I don't really know because now that I use it, I kind of see that it's like a little bit darker for my skin. So I'm like, did when I got matched for that, it was perfect. So I'm wondering if I was like a little bit tan. Girl, I don't know. I was in the sun a little bit more than I am now. I'm never like in the sun anymore. So I noticed that it was a little bit darker. On camera, it looks like I'm an Oompa Loompa. Like on my recent Get Ready With Me, first of all, my foundation in person did not look like that. But in person, it did look a little bit off. So today, I matched it better to my skin tone, as you guys can tell. Because what I went in and did was I had to mix it with my BB cream, my favorite BB cream. I'll show you guys. Everything is an absolute mess. But if I can find it, oh my gosh, you guys, what in the craziness? Okay this oh. this i mixed my nars fiji foundation with this dr jart bb premium beauty balm it's a bb cream and i love it because it has spf 40 in it it has niacinamide it has all kind of things in it that are actually good for the skin so i mixed it with this and i was like dude i need to get more of this girl I swear to gosh i stock up on everything look at me two brand new boxes this is the darker shade because i mixed these two together to get my shade but that's the shade that i mixed with my nars fiji i'm stocked up i'm smart if you didn't watch my recent get ready with me i bought a million lip glosses <laughs> mm, that smells good i would redo my lips but it's like way too late at night but if you guys want to know what i did for my lips earlier at first i just took an eyeshadow this roasted eyeshadow in this um revolution chocolate s'mores palette and i just lined my lips with that and then i got my famous um oh i got too much okay perfect i got my famous my all-time favorite fenty beauty hot uh cocoa or hot chocolate lip gloss and i like put that on there and then in the middle i put this liquid lipstick and if you want to know how i got sit down because i'm gonna i'm gonna um watch the show with you um and if you want to get like a pack of these liquid lipsticks, I put the link down below in my recent get ready with me. Um, love it. But even better, I forgot because I had bought um, lip liners on Amazon and I got like the darkest one I could see. I'm not sure where it's at. And it still was not as dark as that dang eyeshadow that's cute lined with my lips. But when I on my recent get ready with me, once again, I went to Sephora and I got this lip liner. It is the one size lip liner in the shade coin collector and this is actually like the same exact shade as i did with the eyeshadow so i just lined my lips with this like a pretty thick line and i did the same exact thing this is a really good lip liner and melts right on um same exact thing i added some fenty beauty and then in the middle i added this liquid lipstick and this comes in a pack on amazon you guys so yeah i'm getting better my eyebrows are pretty fleeky today and i did like a natural shadow this is like my kind of like favorite look this is like the um the chloe Yasmine um look i love it you guys we've started your order we'll contact you to choose a substitute if any items are unavailable i really hope no items are unavailable was it today that we were watching that or yesterday we were watching that cop cams where that girl was like i have to go to work yesterday i'm sorry you guys we were watching okay i like to watch cop cams and there was this girl on there and i guess you can look it up it says like when you call the police to scare your boyfriend i guess her boyfriend was like yelling at her so then she called the police and then when the police got there she came out like going crazy she was like i don't have time for this i have to go to work why are you here i have to go to work they're like well you called us she was like i didn't call you i never called you you guys have to watch it it's funny like i actually can't act it out because it's actually hilarious and um they were like well a number well your phone called her she's like i never called you they said well they called back the number that called them her phone starts ringing she was like hello and his phone said hello and she was like oh I have two numbers on my phone, actually. And then she's like, please, I have to go to work. So her boyfriend on the other side of the door, on the other side of the door is thinking that they're hurting her. So his little bug comes out and was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? So they have to tase him. And then, I'm oh, sorry, what, what else was funny that they put her in the car and she was like, I have to go to work. Ah! <laughs> they're pulling off. She's like, why do I have to go to jail? Because like, they're like your behavior, like blah, blah, blah. So they put her in the car and they're taking off. She won't tell them their uh, her name, nothing. So they're taking her to jail. She's like, okay, okay, my birthday is this. My social security is this. 
It is the funniest cop cam I've actually ever watched, and I watch a lot of cop cams. It is the funniest in the world. If you like to watch cop cams, look up. Like, girl tries to scare her boyfriend by calling the police, or like, when you call the police to scare your boyfriend. It is the funniest thing in the world. You know what? I'm gonna set up my night for perfection. So, if I wash my makeup off now, the snacks are up the street, I'll have my makeup off, and I'll be able to lay down, eat snacks, watch a movie, and go to bed. Probably won't even brush my teeth. It's not gonna go to bed with snacks on your teeth. It's not. So do not follow my lead. But that is the perfect night. Wash your makeup off, get some comfy clothes on, eat snacks, watch a movie, and go to bed. And you guys, you know what? All that crap talking I was doing that one time, I tried that Origins. Ow, that hurts. I tried. Ow. I tried that Origins um, oil cleanser. It works so good to clean my makeup off. Ow. Okay, that's better. Okay. <laughs> All right, she is literally up the street. What is it? 7:28. She'll be here at 7:29, babe. I'm gonna keep this phone propped up so I can let you know. Okay. <laughs> this stuff right here melts your makeup off like nothing else. It's delivered. So basically, y'all, next thing we got going on is I just gotta get this bathroom cleaned up and then. Jordan, go get my freaking snacks! Them boys, man. I told y'all, they be like besties. Yeah, right. Rawr! You're so cute. I'm gonna leave this out here and you're gonna feel how heavy this bag is. It's heavy? It's cause there's Gatorades in there. Exactly. And three Baja Blasts. Baja Blasts. <laughs> Them Baja Blasts got caffeine. They had me hyped. You think my Baja Blast is disgusting? You're so pretty. Your code red is disgusting. Oh, uh, wait. Wasn't you asking for ice in a cup so you can drink? Because you poured it towards my Baja Blast! Hey. <laughs> you funny, girl. Even though their code red is actually good. Facts. But I have Baja Blast. Alright, now I'm gonna go on with the foaming cleanser. Nice and wide. Moisturizer. My room is sickening, I know. Snack haul. So, we got three of these, two for Jordan, one for me. Minga. Um, I got three Baja Blast, cause these are so good on ice. Yes, girl. Gatorades. Cause we're gonna be thirsty. I got a grape one. This the grape one's for me though, buddy. I got the Glacier Glacier Freeze. If you'd like that one, I have another grape one though. If you want it, I have lemon lime. That's for me, and another grape one. And I got. I thought I got more than this. <laughs> um, he got sour lifesavers, and I got twin snakes because they're sweet and sour. Look at that, Succotash. This is awesome. We have the same favorite chips, which is the Doritos Dynamita. He put me on, even though I've had them before, but like ever since getting with him, like since they're his favorite, like I've allowed my mind to understand like why they're his favorite. And now they're like my favorite. Super cold, nice Gatorade. Do you want one? Uh, Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by its toe. Here. I think I should probably have the grape. You can have a grape. I'm just no, no, no. Yeah, have a grape. Oh. I have two. Yeah, got you. Got you. Go eat you. Thank you. You're welcome. Ooh. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm not gonna have no more Mountain Dew because girl, that is full of caffeine. Mm. So, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and start eating our snacks and start settling down for bed. My face is getting redder because it's hot over here. What are you doing? All your body heat is terrible. Is that closed? No, no, my vents are not closed. It's your body heat. You hot, Cheeto? Um, your girl's gonna go ahead and head up out of here. I love every single one of you guys. God bless you all in Jesus' name. And it's time for your girl and Jordan to go. Bye. Bye.
here you do it.